yo, check this out. Live from the rap line. Don't you know that this record store is mine? And we get ready to go inside now. You know what I'm saying? We pick some CDs. I met Chuck, um, you know, at the time, you know, I was, in, I was involved in the band. And um, <clears throat> they had a group called Spectrum City. And they were also doing radio shows at the time. And, um, you know, I was with this band and I was practicing, you know, at this building. So I didn't know Spectrum was upstairs. And I went upstairs one day and everything, right? <laughs> It was so dope, man, because I went up there and I mean, you know, I used to always crack jokes, you know, I used to just always snap on people's mom, you know, the whole nine and everything. And, you know, I went up there and we started snapping jokes and stuff. And, and I was like, who is this guy? He I had a, 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 a wet jerry curl. <laughs> and he had a, a black pack of cigarettes. <laughs> And you know he was playing you know the stuff on his keyboard. On the keyboard like, and stuff. And you yeah, know man. he really came up there and son of berserk and introduced me to him. Yeah. If they do their job, that's really supposed to be for the right of all people to really be true and equal. <clears throat> then they wouldn't be viewed as a threat. But since they back something that's <clears throat> hypocritical, hey, if I'm feeling I'm right. I feel that they're wrong in a lot of aspects, especially after they killed off a lot of black leaders. You know, I don't really feel bad that, you know, that I'm number one on the list or Ice-T or Ice Cube is number one. We got to say what we got to say. They can't shut us up. Well, let me say, you know, life ain't a joke. You know what I'm saying? Life is a serious, you know, issue. You know what I'm saying? Life is the most important thing that we have. You know, and it's not like, you know, as Chuck delivering political speeches, I'm on the side joking. I mean, you know, see, one thing about this group, this group, you know, we, 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 we bring out both sides of life. There's a serious side, but then there's a happy side too, you know. Uh, you gotta be able to laugh, you know what I'm saying sometimes. You know, I mean, you know, if somebody's serious all the time and no laughter, something's wrong. But if somebody's always laughing all the time, ha, 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 never serious, Something's wrong. So, you know, what you got to do is to be able to, you know, get both sides of the fence. You know what I'm saying? To this side, there's that side. To every, her side, there's his side. To our side, there's their side. You know what I'm saying? So if you don't understand what Chuck is saying lyrically, sometimes, you know, you can look on the side and, and it looks like I'm joking, but little do you know, I'm acting out his lyrics, you know, the, the best that I can. If you don't understand what he's saying lyrically, then understand body language. Like, I'm joking, but sometimes I do got to add a little humor, you know. <laughs> well, sometimes, sometimes, like, even when we do 911 is a joke and I don't want to be called your nigga on the stage, I got to act out what he's saying, you know, and he does the same thing. And, you know, a lot of people will say, you know, a public enemy, we try to give you all viewpoints. A lot of times people don't think Flavor could get serious, but he'd be serious. A lot of people don't think I could get funny, but of course, in real life, yeah, I, I could be a funny guy. But, um, you know, as far as the image of the group, you know, we give those two sides.